the pandemic spreads, more people are wondering about drug treatments currently being tested. KCAL 9 Orange County reporter Michelle Gilly talked to an infectious disease specialist who is very cautiously optimistic about one drug being eyed at UC Irvine. The curve um, of infection, the spread, is going to peak in the next couple weeks. And about the same time, results are expected on the effectiveness of a drug called remdesivir. Dr. Jerrica Lamb specializes in viral infections and drug treatment. The infectious disease pharmacist and Chapman University professor says she is cautiously optimistic about remdesivir for those with COVID-19. UCI Medical Center just began a clinical trial on the antiviral medication at its hospital in Orange. Knowing that COVID-19 is caused by the coronavirus, that it would make sense for me to use an antiviral to fight against the virus. And remdesivir is an antiviral agent. And even though it has been studied against Ebola and hasn't been found to be effective in phase three trials, it just makes sense to me to, to use something that has been demonstrated against viruses versus using an antimalarial or an antibiotic. According to Dr. Lam, results from a drug trial underway in China on patients taking remdesivir are due in April, which will steer the direction of whether the critically ill should get the drug therapy. She understands the stress that so many are experiencing because there are so many unknowns. Please do not be afraid. Just have faith in the healthcare providers and healthcare system and your scientists and researchers that we're doing our utmost best to help find a treatment for this virus, for this, this infection. But she admits more should have been done in the U.S. as COVID-19 spread in Asia and Italy. We should have been prepared much, much earlier. And politically, things happen. You know, I, I don't want to go there, but we, we should have things set in place uh, and I heard that things were set in place uh, after Ebola has landed in our country and, and those systems, checks and balances were dissolved. In Fullerton, Michelle Geely, KCAL 9 News.